Good hello, welcome to One Ian Skin, a nice simple one today, how to perform a parallax in harmony. Two characters, looks like they're about to have a bit of a fight. Camera needs to move from the left across to the right. Easy. With of course these several layers of background, all moving a little bit less than the one before it. How do we do that? First step, plus button here, go to the camera. Now, camera can be grabbed and moved around the screen at the moment, but no keyframes appear. We want to be able to animate it. To do that, press on the add peg button here, select the first frame, add a keyframe. And now with the move position tool, I'm going to slide it across to the left, add another keyframe at the end, slide across to the right. The movement is working, but we want a bit of an ease. Select all of them and this button here, go down to night. No, Go down to this middle S one there. There we go. Ended up making it about 30 frames long, somewhere in the middle. So that's quite effective. Now to slow down the layers in the background with 3D space. Harmony is a 2D program existing within a three dimensional space. So go to windows and select top. And get a nice top view that looks like this. This yellow triangle is the camera and the black bar across is all of our layers stacked up perfectly on top of one another. Picking up and moving the camera from this view means we can zoom in and out of our scene. But until we add some depth to the layers, it's not gonna do a whole lot. So, if I grab these trees and start moving them back, you see the effect quite clearly. As it moves in front, the layers sort of rearrange themselves and as it goes into the back. If I pick up the camera now, you'll notice the 3D effect is really quite powerful. Organizing the layers like this is a bit of a chore though. As it gets further away, of course, things get smaller. Uh, we're 2D animators. We draw things the way we see them. We want things to be able to get further away while maintaining the same size. That's what this button here is for. The one fourth most to the left is called maintain size. Now, if I grab this and I push it back, you'll notice that that pink line is going back there. But from our camera's point of view, it seems to be staying exactly the same. This is perspective view. It'll show a little bit more clearly what's happening. As it goes backwards, it is getting enormous. As it comes closer to the camera, it gets smaller and smaller and smaller. Just so that from the point of view of where we're sitting, it looks like it doesn't change at all. So the next step, simple enough. I'm gonna get each of these layers and pen them back an appropriate amount, getting me something like this. Let's see what happens if I pan across now. There we go. So that's starting to look a bit better, but I want it to be a lot more extreme. I've deliberately drawn some of these layers to be a bit shorter than others. These buildings don't go all the way to the left. So that can help act as a bit of a guide for how much movement I want to have. For the buildings to be all the way to the left, when it goes to the right. Okay, see, it's still moving a bit too much. So I'm gonna push it back a bit further. Yellow stick figure, change that to animate off. And we can move these things around without fear of accidentally creating new keyframes. Just be sure to turn it back on again because you will forget and then you will move things around and accidentally not be animating anything. Okay, I've spaced things out pretty appropriately now. But there's one layer I don't wanna be moving at all. That's the clouds. They're so far away, parallax isn't going to affect them. But because a camera is moving in physical space, there's no real way that the clouds can become locked, right? Well, remember this camera is inside of a peg. If I put the clouds inside that same camera peg, then the clouds will move. Keep your eye up here. Notice the clouds are moving. However, they are moving along with the camera. So once again, from the camera's point of view, they stay completely still. 3D Parallax, give it a go. Working files for this video and all other on Onion Skin, available to patrons. Have a poke around my stuff for a whole lot more on harmony and animation in general. Take care.